let's start hello welcome back to my channel and today in this episode we are going to try a dry clay things for home decor like ring holder coaster and wall hanging as well throughout the video you can see the process how i started with the clay and ended up with beautiful home decor things and hopefully you will get inspired with the video and make your own let's start chalo to let's start with the things you need you need one air dry clay i have taken fevicryl molded and then you need acrylic paints of any brand you like cup for jewelry tray basically a mold for it then a cloth paint brushes toothpick scissors knife for a cutter wool for hanging wall decor glass of water rolling pin and something for the ambience i have taken the candle so let's start making the jewelry tray here we have the fevicryl molded air dry clay it has two parts a hardener and one resin base so you have to unwrap both of them and mix them together so it will take a while to mix them together so do whatever you want roly poly flatten it uh, do it with a rolling pin so basically you have to mix both of the yeast and make it one <laughs> After a lot of mixing, trashing, or rolling, whatever, you'll have this beautiful clay. I'm rolling on a plastic sheet because I don't want it to stick it to my beautiful paper. When you are satisfied with the thickness and the shape. I have this big cup so I can take it as a reference and then you have to put the cup over the clay and then start cutting the extra clay around it with the help of a knife or a cutter whatever suits you After cutting the extra clay unmold the jewelry tray and you'll find a perfect circle now whatever uh, clay was left i rolled it again and i tried to give a um, side border to the tray so i put the rolled clay around it now you want to have some depth to the tray so that you have you can put the jewelry in it so for that again use the same cup as a mold and just give it some depth to it like poke it in the middle so that it goes down in the middle and leave that overnight so that it can dry up good morning this is the next day and today i'm going to make the wall hanging so for that same drill you have to take the clay and mix them together roly poly for the wall hanging i have two full circles two semi circles one rainbow so i need these and when you make these poke holes on each element on both sides i have missed it in the semi uh, semi circles that was a huge mistake i had to glue the thread together later at later stage you'll see it my favorite part was ma making this rainbow it looks so adorable Smooth 
smooth the edges out of every element with uh, some water and just smooth the edges out and poke the holes that's the drill you have to remember and do it fast so that the clay doesn't dry out you can make different cook uh, cookie cutters or clay cutters from different things i've used glass bottle sometimes i use the catch kit up pick a dhakkan whatever it's lying around you just use that for the mold for the reference some clay left and i wanted to give the uh, ring holders to both my mom and my chachi so i made some more ring holders this is me making ring holders in front of you i think it was the easiest element of them all and i enjoyed making it now all your elements are done keep it overnight i typically kept it for one day and then they they will be ready for painting take acrylic colors for painting This is the coaster I had already made before shooting this video so I'm painting it now with the rest of the elements so whatever you like for the coaster I'm doing a white base and golden rim and I'll just do some polka dots in the middle the jewelry tray we made i'll do it again full white green borders and i'll just do the spray or some chittas of some other color <laughs>
assembling my claymate things for another fashion show so that is all i made these and it was really fun to make these and it was actually a therapy for me such a fun making them you can do this too it's it's so easy to make and you can try different things with this clay so many possibilities and you can go on pinterest and get inspired and start making that's all bye